So guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this amazing lab and many if you are facing issues like you are unable to complete this lab so here is the updated solution guide for it so first of all click on start lab and if you are completely new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel just open the cloud console incognito window and here basically we have to just follow step by step video and we have to complete the lab without any issue now if you need any skill badges and lab free courses you can check the description box of this video now here basically you have to just click on i understand and then you have to just activate the cloud shell so now from here you have to just activate the cloud shell okay just click on this button and here you have to just click on continue and then authorize yourself and it will take few seconds so just wait for it Now once the cloud shell is now ready it will look like this now you have to move to the lab instruction come to the task number one specifically first thing is that you have to set the zone and after that we have to create the cluster okay now cluster creation will take 5 to 10 minutes sometimes even up to 15 minutes so you need to wait for it and if you haven't liked the video yet do like the video and subscribe the channel Now once the cluster is ready we have to just copy the sample code so just run this command one by one it will take some time now after that we have to change the directory now just create the deployment now we have to just expose it so here if you try to check the score you may not get the score instantly because the reason is that it takes time to update the score when you run this you can see here external IP is not visible and you need to wait for some time till the external IP is populated you can run this get service command again and again and or you can just wait for two to three minutes and retry okay so just wait for some time and retry so finally here you can see the external IP is now ready now just open a new tab and just click on continue when you see this page you can just move it how i copied i dragged the ip and just pasted it okay now just check the score now come over here and just create another directory now here just create this file and then after that we have to open a new terminal so just click on this plus icon and just run this port forwarding command 
and come back to the first terminal and run this command. So now again run the second command and run the third command also. Now here it is asking for password. Here is the password. Just paste it. The password won't be visible. You have to just copy carefully and just paste it. Okay. Now just export the token. If you are getting this kind of output, then as we have already exported the password, you can just end the session by using Control C. Now run this command. Now you have just logged in. Now open a third terminal. Okay. And then just export the logs. Just run it. And now again, we have to just, once you have exported the logs, you can see here, now we have to just create the service. So come to the task number one, basically shell number one. And just paste it over here like this. Now again, run the next command. Now just create the service file. Just check the score. Now here it will take some time for the score to update. If you are feeling that the video is too fast, just use the slow speed. Okay, just use the slow speed. You can just decrease the speed. Just right. And I, as I repeat, the lab takes time to update the score. So you need to wait for the score to get updated. So just wait for some time and then we'll retry to check the score. Try to check the score again after three to four minutes it will be updated now run this command to create a firewall finally the firewall has also been created now just check the score for this particular task just keep running one by one we are just adding labels to the ports now just keep running one by one like this just check the score you won't get the score instantly as i said earlier Wait for some time for the ports to get updated and then you'll get the score without any issue. Now here we have to create the deployment. Basically we are in the last task. Okay. So just keep running one by one. And once it is done, we'll verify. So here you can see again external IP is pending. Wait for the external IP to get populated. It will take some time and once it is populated, then we'll just open a new tab and check also or you can just check the score you'll get the score without any issue and for other lab free courses and skill badges you can check the description box so finally after trying for multiple times the lab basically the external ip is now enabled now come back to the lab instructions and just check the score and that's how we completed the lab do like the video and subscribe the channel if you need this check my progress bar you can check the description box of this video